Hey guys, it's Zayna here. Welcome and welcome. Bleh. Hey guys, it's Zayna here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Um, today, as you can see by the title of the video and probably my surroundings, we're going to be filming a sneaker haul. And this is probably going to take everything out of me. And it's probably going to have to be two parts. Um, story time. My first pair of Jordans were flights. Like the set, the ones that look like sevens, but they're like flights. Air Jordan flights. And I was so ecstatic. I was like, oh, I'm popping. I got Jordans. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Then I remember getting Jordan 4s, which were my like actual first pair of retros. And then I got Jordan 5s. And then it got to the point where it had seven pair of Jordans. And I was like, oh, I have enough sneakers to wear each one, like, like once each and every day of the week or something like that. And then ever since there, I just skyrocketed and I just started getting sneakers that I liked and ended up here, like there. And then I have some down here. And then there's more in my closet. These are just like, these are just Jordan's, the silhouettes from 1 to 12, but I'm going to show them from, no, 1 to 14. But honestly, I wouldn't call myself like a hype beast because like I don't have like hype beast shoes that like, or like collector's shoes or whatever. Honestly, I just like, when I first started buying shoes, I bought what I liked or like if I went in the store and I seen something that I liked, then I would probably pick it up. Um, So a lot of these are kind of like, what is, what, what is that? Or like really girly sneakers or i don't know but i've accumulated these over the past i want to say four or five years so a handful of them are well of my jordans at least are really are like kind of old and they are like cooked like done off done off done off done off done off done off but i'm still gonna show them anyway for the sake of it because like i still have them they're still sneakers and yeah so disclaimer you're gonna see some dirty shoes but like having them all out here gives me the opportunity to actually clean them yeah so i know this video is gonna be long already because so let's just get into it so like i have a little table here that i'm gonna be resting the box on and then i'm just talking about the shoe okay the first i might give like a little story because i can i feel like i have a little story for like a lot of these shoes okay so the first pair are I wear size six in boys. Um, so the first pair are Air Jordan Futures. Um, I got these in the, I want to say, eighth grade. And everybody clowned me for having them because they're like, oh, why is your sneaker so twisted up like that? And then a month later, everybody and their moms had um Jordan Futures on. So I was just like, oh, Chen Sitter, period. Um, yeah, these are the reflective care. And they turned into my, like, rain sneakers in, like, 8th grade, towards the end, and like, ninth grade. But, yeah, these are, um, them. They're reflective. As you can see, they're old, because, like, the bottoms are yellow. But, um, there's not really much to it. I mean, I can <laughs> kind of see why people clown me for them. But, I mean, who cares? You buy what you like, you wear what you like. And at the end of the day, they didn't buy it. And they're not wearing it. So why do you care? So that's that. Okay, the next pair. Or Jordan 14. Oh, got my nails done, whatever. Oh, no. I can't show that. My hands is ashy, baby. Okay, what are these? Oh, okay. Um, I got these online at... I forgot which store. So these are Jordan 14s. These are the sport blue colorway, I think, I believe. Um, this is a shoe that I definitely don't wear anymore. Um, I got these in the eighth grade as well. I don't know how I feel about this shoe. Now looking at it, it's kind of ugly to me. But it was cute back then. I definitely don't wear these anymore. And also going through all these sneakers gives me the opportunity to see which sneakers I don't want anymore so that I can give them away. So it's kind of a win-win situation. Um, next pair of sneakers or our Jordan Jordan 13s. I got these for finish um at finish line. As you can see, that's when they used to, like I did the raffle, and then they called me. You're like, yeah, you won the raffle. I was just like, hey, these are the Barons. These are cooked. 
oh my god i used to wear these like every single day in eighth grade i love these shoes these were like my favorite shoes back then they matched with everything i wore them in the rain the snow the sleet the hail you name it like oh my god i'm i'm kind of embarrassed to show some to show some of these sneakers because like back then i didn't really care about how my sneakers like how i managed them or like how roughed up they got but like now like as i got older and started buying more and more sneakers with my own money i was like dang i really need to take care of them um so yeah these are the baron 13s and they're kind of like iridescent they're iridescent on the back that's the team and like you could tell a lot of these shoes are old because of the box because if you know sneakers and jordans like you know the box does not look like that anymore well especially for grade school um this this is actually a newer box now that i speak about the boxes yeah it has the golden jump man um i don't know what these are um these are the french blue 12s um when did i get these i want to say probably my freshman year of high school i want to say um yeah there's not much to it obviously they're really dirty again i wore these a pretty good amount probably not as much as i used to because 12s because i have wide feet and like right here is kind of tight so yeah right but at almost 10 minutes and i only went through what four pairs of sneakers <sighs> i got my braids done what i want okay next um if you know sneakers then you should already know what this is my most recent pair of jordan slash nike sneakers you should already know these babies are so clean my pair is a little bit flawed like glue stains and like extra stitching but it's okay it's okay mm. uh, do my light just die Excuse me? Uh, uh, how rude. Nah, that's crazy. First of all, I didn't even know you could charge this thing. When I was actually thoroughly getting into my video, you want to die? Are you kidding me? So, technical difficulties. I'm um, sorry if you see that the lighting changed a little bit. I don't know if it really changed drastically or if it changed at all. But um, if it did and if you notice it, sorry. Um, So, let's get back into the video. All right, so I was talking about these babies, the Bread 11s, um, pretty self-explanatory, bread, black and red colorway, OG colorway, like, uh, this is just a really, really, really clean shoe, like, the gloss, I just, I just really love it, and that new shoe smell, because these are dead stock, and I'm waiting for everybody to wear their pair out so that I can bring mine out show you these are the bread elephants and i'm so excited and they came with this cute little came with this card or whatever and i really like the box because usually like i feel like only the men's pair comes with a box like this i don't know if that's just me but yeah that's the bread elephants all right what's next another pair of 11 As you can tell these are oh, oh my god these are so old all right, funny story. I remember I wanted these when they came out. And it was probably, I want to say, I don't know, elementary school. And um, release day, I couldn't get them. I know. I did not want them at first. But then I saw it all around me. And I was just like, dang, I want those. And I couldn't get them anywhere. So I settled for another pair that's kind of like this, which you'll see later on into the video. Um, And then I think I got these for Christmas. I bought it off of like a reseller for like double the price but i thought it was worth it and clearly it was the way that these shoes look right now and i don't even want to show them but i had these shoes since the eighth grade and i'm now a freshman in college so you do the math um yeah the legend blue 11s <laughs> legend blues they're not even blue anymore like the sole is yellow all right this is what the sole used to look like this is what the sole used to look like and this is my sole <sighs> i mean quote in the tongue box like you can see like the stitching coming out and everything like i wore these shoes till the death of me um these are probably my favorite shoes back then even though i don't know if it's just me but 11s like they kind of hurt my feet so now i know i can i have to size up which i did with the bread 11s but i didn't know that back then because you know fresh in the game for me 
but yeah these are the legend blue 11s and nothing more to say let me just put these away <laughs> oh that kind of rhymed um next pair another pair of 11s the midnight navy 11s midnight navy 11s i don't remember when i got these um sometime in high school for sure probably like my freshman or sophomore year in high school um there's not much to say about them but i like them they're cute so this box is empty and i feel like these shoes are my space jam 11s but i am not 100 percent sure yeah these are definitely my space jam 11s um i insert a picture i guess hopefully i'll remember okay next um another pair of 11s surprise surprise oh, these are the 7210 11s not much to say your simple black upper white sole i don't know if it came with the translucent bottom or like a yellow bottom like this but mine are yellow so yeah that's that please don't tell me these are another pair of 11s okay now we're on to 10s these are oh my god these are so old i think i got these in the seventh grade um i'm just gonna show them real quick because they're mad old these are the venom 10s um yeah those are the venom 10s okay these are another pair of 10s these are the charlotte 10s um but i know when they came up with these they came up with like different pairs for different states so i know they had the nyc i should probably have gotten those because i'm from nyc but the venom 10s like low-key low-key look like the nyc colorway because they're both black so yeah and i just like the, this colorway um charlotte. yeah those are my charlotte clearly have no more space over here so we just <laughs> all right next is okay a pair of nines okay oh okay i got these my um freshman year of high school as my back to school sneaker and honestly i don't even wear these anymore and i kind of find them very ugly now i don't even know what they're called oh statute 10 statute nines so it's like this doodle -doo green and i don't even know why i got these and yeah that's all i have to say they're nines and yeah i'm just gonna put that away um these are another pair of nines these are my favorite sneakers probably still one of my favorite sneakers these are the baron nines um as you can see i wore them a lot because like the stitching is starting to come out and it has wrinkles and stuff but i kind of i mean honestly i will still throw these on till this day depends it depends on the fit yeah i feel like i have a lot of like really really old sneakers that you don't see people wearing anymore except for like my ones and maybe my 11 um what's next oh jordan eights oh god oh baby i'm wiping these down before i can show this camera because uh-uh and then the next pair of eights oh baby you would think they were like buried six feet under these are the aqua eights um not much to say i used to love these sneakers so much but i haven't worn them since like freshman or sophomore year of high school but i'm about to pull them out the closet again can you see it you see it um and like the sparkly i don't know if y'all can see it but like the the bottom has the um the aqua part has glitter on it and I know when, like, the shoe first came out, a lot of people were, like, not really happy that it had the glitter because it made it seem like it was, like, more on a feminine side. But I didn't really care, obviously. And I still got my Jordan sticker in here. These are another pair of eights. And I got these in the seventh grade as my back-to-school sneaker off some random store down the strip. Oh, my God. I, I don't even want to show these. These are so old. I haven't worn these since ninth, eighth grade. What are these? The playoff eights. I might just insert a picture because I'm embarrassed to show these on camera because they're so dirty. Yeah, I can't do that to myself. The playoff eights, search it up. Or if I just so happen to put the picture. Oh my God, I think you want this. All right, let me just take some of them down. So now we're on to sevens. These are the Olympic sevens. And these are like the updated version. I wanted the old, like the old version fire they need to re-release those but um these are pretty cute i don't wear them that much as you can see they're pretty clean um we got the gold what do you call this aglets 
I'm thinking of like the Phineas and Ferb episode. Um, yeah, and it just has the red, white, and blue, obviously, with the red splattered on the sole. Yeah, there's not really much to it. Yeah. Um, and next, another pair of sevens. Oh, I got these in the seventh or eighth grade, and they're really dirty. So, yeah, I'm honestly at this point, all my sneakers are dirty. Um, these are the French blue sevens. Um, yeah. I dead don't wear these anymore. I don't wear like oh my god. When I tell you, I probably only wear ones and then like my other sneakers like like that are different brands. Like honestly, I'm tired of Jordan brands. These are a pair of Jordan sixes. All right, both sixes that I have are really girly, so don't come for me. Um yeah, they're really yellow. Um they're really 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 yellow. I wore them a lot because this color matched um my uniform shirt. So yeah the girl sixes i feel like i have such like not even underrated just like low-key shoes i don't know i don't know i'm probably just chatting off um another pair of sixes yeah these are the grape sixes oh yeah the carmines but i didn't get the carmines because i got these um yeah they're literally the carmines but with purple so yeah they're grape sixes and it has like the ultraviolet pink at the back and on the tongue I don't know. I hope I'm showing this correctly. Because, baby, I am not filming this again. <laughs> mm -mm. Um, these are Jordan 5s. Oh, my God. Why don't I remember the name of these? I remember the... Oh, yeah. I think they're called the Metallic 5s. Not the black colorway. I don't know. But um, I wanted these shoes so bad. And I had to beg my mother. Like, Mom, they're going to sell out. I have to get them now if I'm ever going to get them. And I wore these shoes like oh baby like you if you see them like the paint is gone on like one of the pairs but i don't think i'm gonna show that side and it's dead this pair too <laughs> but just know these are the melanic i believe they're called metallic fives i don't know or all white fives or something like that but these shoes oh my god these are my favorite sneakers but yeah metallic fives these are jordan fours oh, okay these i probably worn i don't even like no more than 10 times and i don't know why i just i don't know these are the motorsport fours motorsport put that thing in sports skirt, skirt. attention i'm gonna need you to face front you don't want to smoke with me this is a lace blunt all right enough of that um yeah honestly I, you can tell like i don't really wear these that much but i'm gonna bring them out when it gets nicer because this is a really nice shoe actually um yeah they're pretty clean because i never really wore them that much obviously like I said, like the past three times. So yeah, motorsport force. Um, next is another pair of fours. Oh my god, these are my favorite pair of shoes. They turned into my everyday sneakers, wear them in the rain and everything. Really dirty. I think I stopped wearing these in like 10th grade. I probably pulled them out once or twice. Like you could tell I wore these a lot because of the sole on the bottom. Disappeared. Um, yeah, but these are the Oreo for, or, uh, Oreo, or Oreo, Oreo, Oreo fours, Oreo fours, whatever. Um, not really much to it. You could tell, like, look at that dust right there. Like, that's literally just a blob of dust. Um, yeah, I wore these a lot. I like them because they went with everything. So, yeah. Um, these are, next is a pair of threes. I think it's my only pair of threes which are the sport blue threes like the um i love these i love the shoe i still wear the shoe from time to time to be honest um i haven't worn it in a minute because threes are a little snug on me but i just love these sh i love it love it love it love it i got these as my back to school shoe in the eighth grade and i wore them throughout high school still gonna pull them out probably take them back to campus with me to be honest yeah, I'm thinking about it. But yeah, that's the Sport Blue threes. I feel I hope I hope I'm showing them like properly and like enough. What is this? Oh, okay. All right. Uh, now on to my favorite silhouette. Jordan ones. Oh my god, I'm so excited. All right. So these are the first pair. These are the Legend Blue ones, which I got originally when I didn't have the Legend Blue Elevens, but then I got the Legend Blue Elevens, so I had I guess the pair, the pack. Um. They're really dirty, but they're still pretty cute, to be honest. They're like the they're mids. Um, honestly, 
I'm about to clean these up and pull them out in the summertime because this is a really nice colorway. It's sleek, simple, clean, you know? So yeah, now that I look at you, you cut you you making a comeback, yeah. What is this? Oh, I bought these. I was literally at my internship in the summertime at work. And I was like, yo, these sneakers come out today. So I'm here trying to do my work. My supervisor and all the co-workers are passing me by. And I'm trying to sneak my phone, trying to purchase these shoes online. They, they came back in stock. Oh, my God. But um, these are the New Love Ones. Oh, these shoes are so clean. They're mid. Um, I just love how vibrant that the yellow is. Honestly, it kind of shows up a little different on camera. Some kicks you would say. So yeah. Those are my babies. Oh. Okay. Uh, oh. These are my favorite pair of wands. Oh my god, I think. These and one other pair are my favorite. Like, I wear them once, twice a week, um, if not more. Like, you could tell the paint is literally coming off. But I feel like once, I feel like when the toe box is kind of, like, creased but not too much. Like, when the leather is, like, rippling and the stitching on the checks are kind of, like, pulling out. Um, and, like, the paint is kind of faded. I feel like that's when it looks its best. It's like, um cool gray wait what yeah cool gray ones no what why am i blinking the heck shadows what the heck i'm dumb shadow ones though the black toe ones oh my god i love these shoes i wear them so much yeah i love these shoes so freaking much my babies and they still pretty they look pretty good for a shoe that i wear I would just once a week, every week since I've gotten them. Like, it's that crazy. These are also another pair of my favorite ones, which are the Royal Blue Ones. Classic Royal Blue Ones. Can't go wrong with putting this shoe on. Like, I feel like the shoe matches with everything. Um, Love the shoe. Ain't nothing much to say, but baby. Fire! These are the Sport, sport Blues. Oh, really? Yeah, sport blue ones. These are fire. Um, all ones are fire. Love this shoe. Um, these are the pine green ones. But yeah, these are the pine green ones. They're mad cute. And I love them. I love all my ones. Lastly, honestly, funny story. These sneakers, I I literally have never worn them. They're still dead stock till this day. Um, I got this for Christmas, probably like, I want to say three Christmases ago. And I just feel like you cannot wear these shoes all the time. Like, you have to find the right occasion. But I promise you, 2020, I'm bringing these shoes out. I'm bringing these shoes out. These are, oh, I feel like these are not, these are like low-key heat. But like, they're heat at the same time. But yeah, these are the maroon velvet ones. I was going to get the velvet 11s, but I didn't like how this looked in the 11 silhouette. I feel like they look so much better with the in the ones version. And look at that Air Jordan like tag. Like what? What? Look at that. Fire, bro. And look at the aglets, bro. Look at the aglets, bro. Wait. Look at the aglets, bro. Come on now. Come on. That's fire. Like I've never worn these sneakers, but I promise you, I promise you, I'm pulling them out this year, bro. So yeah, that's it for the Jordan sneakers, like numbers or whatever. I'm really going to do a part two to this because I can't put them all together because then the video will probably be like an hour long. Um, So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. And probably, I don't know, comment down below a pair of sneakers that I have that you have or your favorite pair of sneakers that I have or something that you thought i would have but i don't have i don't know something sneaker related maybe um be sure to like comment and subscribe of course and share with your friends and i hope to see you guys in my next video bye oh baby oh baby let's let one more time if you can't put your phone in and pay on mine